YouTube is the next big thing after Google is what people say and that's a fact. For information we Google and for videos we YouTube. In this video we are going to talk about some important points that we need to keep in mind before you start your YouTube channel. So let's begin. Tip number one. Don't be afraid what people will say, what people will think because people are too busy doing their own stuff. The fear is only till you upload your very first video. You will need a niche to begin your channel. A niche means what topic or a genre will your channel be about. Like my channel is all about photography where I talk about DSLR photography, I talk about mobile photography, about image editing etc. So that is my niche. Point number two. It is actually very simple to select your niche or your genre. Say for example you like playing guitar, you can start a channel based on music where you teach people how to strum the guitar and all the basics. If you are good at cooking, your channel can be a cooking based channel. Basically you got to follow your passion. Point number three. One very common mistake that people make while selecting a niche is by copying someone else's. For instance, if somebody is a stand up comedian and has a channel on comedy, you will think okay why not I also start comedy and gain huge subscriber like how the other person has gained. That's not right. It is his expertise. He can talk endlessly on a topic. So please do not copy someone else's niche. Create your own and you will never be short of content. Point number four. Someone else's journey cannot be yours. You have to start your own journey. Being a new YouTuber, I know it is tough to grow on YouTube but there have been people who have thousands and millions of subscribers, they kept working on a channel without bothering about the outcome and see how successful they are today. Tip number 5 is a super tip. If your channel is a tech based channel, please do not end up uploading a makeup video or a cooking video because your subscriber have subscribed to a channel exclusively for tech based content. In an exclusive authentic Chinese restaurant you can't be serving pizza right mix of different niches or niche on a channel is a total disaster so once your niche is finalized it's always good to go on YouTube and see how fellow content creators are creating videos on similar niche this gives you a good sense of direction gives you good ideas and make sure that you're not creating a repeated content point number six gear does play an important role in creating quality videos but don't wait, there are majority of creators on YouTube who have created their channel and started shooting with a basic smartphone without using expensive equipment or lights etc. Remember that experience is what that matters. Point number 7, well not quite a point but if you want to learn how to shoot videos using your smartphone I have a link right up there. Tip number 8, coming back to shooting and starting your own channel. Select any two to three good topics on your niche and just start recording. If you keep waiting, you may never start. Whatever is with you is your gear. Just hit the record button. Let me show you. Just a moment. Hi, this is HYZ. I just saw Sadik's video on how to create a YouTube channel. And this is my very first video to let you know that I am to start my own channel on tech review. So stay tuned. It's that simple. Upload. Tip number 9. As long as your content is adding value to your audience, they wouldn't mind the initial quality issues because they would understand that your journey has just begun. Tip number 10. You can save up some money and invest in new equipment as you progress. Investing on a good mic should be your top priority because people usually prefer a good audio over a video. You may invest in a new camera, lights and other equipment as you progress and become successful on YouTube. Tip number 11. One mistake that I am making now is that I am not uploading frequently and that is not good. One video per week should be your target. More than one is even better. People who have come to a channel and have subscribed to it want to see content regularly. If you are not going to upload, somebody else will. And this is not good for your channel because your subscriber may start unsubscribing to your channel and they might even forget you. So consistency is the key. Tip number 12, the last one. YouTube is like an ocean. It's not only about shooting, editing and uploading a video and then thinking you're going to get thousands of likes unless you're a celebrity. 
there are many factors that make you successful on YouTube. This video was to help you and to motivate you to start your own YouTube channel right from the basics. Remember, now is the time to start. Imagine 10 years back, you may have wanted to plant a mango tree and reap the benefits now, reap the fruits now. Now is the best time to plant a tree. Now is the time to start your own YouTube channel. In the next video, we are going to talk about some important parameters that you need to keep in mind once you have started your own YouTube channel. I'm sure you don't want to miss out on that. If you like this channel, give us a thumbs up and do subscribe. We will see you soon.